What is going on everybody? It's Jonathan Rodriguez, the junior angler. We're back in for another trout session. So as you know, this is a time of year you want to come target trout when it's cold and these ponds and lakes are stocking these trout. This is the best time to actually catch a trout. So we are here back at Handsome Dam. I haven't been here for a while to actually catch trout. I was here last year when they stocked trout and I did not do so hot, but apparently they just stocked today. So we got our gear. Let's go and try to catch yourself a trout. All right guys, so let me quickly show you guys what you guys need to actually catch these trout at Handsome Dam. Very simple. This is a 1,000 size reel, so you can use any type of spinning reel. I just prefer going small because you don't need that much line. You want to go with a four pound test line, preferably fluorocarbon. Uh, these fish are very finicky. Trout in general, if you don't know, trout are very finicky. And we've got our ultralight rod. This is actually six foot. This thing can throw up to 116 to 38 ounce, two to six pound test line. Look at this thing. This thing is practically a noodle. It's practically a noodle. It's going to be able to throw your little micro jigs, which is what we're going to throw today. This is exactly where we're going to be throwing. These little power bait teasers. I don't know what this imitates, but these trout go crazy for them. So let's tie that on real quick and try to see if we can catch ourselves a trout. Now one thing about the trout here, as far as I know, they're not big. These are like half pounders. They don't stock very big trout in Handsome Dam, but a fish is a fish, eh? There you go, we're securing our knot real quick. There you go. Is ready to throw. Alrighty, Phil. So worst case scenario, we can't catch a trout with uh, these mini jigs. We do actually have power bait as well, but we're gonna try to have it a little more fun way to catch these trout. So let's go for it. You don't have to cast very far for these trout. Make sure you set your drag just right. Of course, these fish aren't very big, so you don't, you know. <laughs> Alrighty, so we fished this little spot for about 20 minutes already, 30 minutes. I think I just got one bite. So we're gonna make it a little spot over there that's cleared up a little closer to the ramp where they stocked them. So we're gonna go closer to their mini jig for a while. Alrighty, fellas, so the micro jig is not working. We're gonna cut this off real quick and try it out on rooster tail. Tie on this little black rooster tail so we get a little more distance. Yeah, I saw the, I saw the fish went away. There you go. Oh, that's a good one. Rooster tail. Well, fellas, it worked. Here you go. I guess Rooster tail did work. <laughs> there you go, guys. Look at that. Nice little rainbow trout. That trout is actually a pretty decent sized one. Nice little trout with my hands and down. Alright fellas, we are making our way out of there. We're gonna try to fish right here by the gate over here. Uh, I know trout here, so let's try to catch one over here. Yeah, I'll take them bro, you done for the day? Yeah, I'm done. Damn. That is nice to meet you guys. Same, bro. I appreciate it, man. Yeah. Nice you. yeah. See you around, man. You know, bro. Your, your videos help. I appreciate it, dude. Thanks, man. That's what I'm here for. Thanks. Sweet. So uh, as you guys saw, some man just gave me a trout. Um, I do have a lot of trout. But yeah, so as you guys saw, I caught those big ones at Fin and Feather. That gave me a lot of meat. So today I'm actually going to give these away, most likely to family and friends. So let's just keep fishing and try to catch more. 
Alrighty fellas, so right now we're gonna try to fish with power bait. No more luck on the rooster, but I know this little spot here does pretty good with power bait. So we're gonna switch this rod up with power bait. Show you guys what I'm doing with that. Alrighty, so we're gonna be using Berkeley power bait. I believe this is the glitter garlic. We're gonna be using size 10 bait holder hooks and little split shots, or you can actually use just a little drop shot weight which is what i'm gonna do it's a little easier to rig up get your line i'm gonna leave about a, a foot liter there you go inch a little drop shot weight grab your hooks you don't want to tie your hook to the end of your line theoretically if you were fishing for trout you do want to use a carolina rig that's possibly one of the most effective ways to catch trout using power bait but i'm going to be using this method since i don't have egg weights so i have to work with what we got there you go Woo! Jeez, you're gonna wanna grab just a little bit of power bait. Just enough to cover the hook. These trout don't have big mouths, so you don't wanna put too much. You're gonna get your hook, get your power bait, and wrap it around. Try your best to conceal the hook. Trout in general are extremely finicky fish, so you wanna make a small little, kinda like a teardrop. That is perfect. Many people add scents after, but that's all I got, so let's go for the cast. Now we wait. This one's more of a waiting game, that's why I personally don't like really using power bait, but it gets bit. You just wait to get bit and see if we catch a trout. And that's about it, fellas. <laughs> power bait bite was not on for me, apparently. I have a big feeling, and I know so that tomorrow these trout will for sure be biting. Uh, we'll see if I come out tomorrow. If not, we are happy with these two little trout. Well, actually, one of them's actually like the pyramid ones we were catching over there. So we're gonna put these dudes on ice and wrap it up and go home and eat these things up. Woo! It's always nice to come out here, you know? Close lake, ponds like this make it all worth it. But yeah, so you don't need much to come out here. You just bring out some rooster tails, power band, you will for sure catch them. Thank you guys for watching and taking the time out of your day to watch this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And it's a Junior Angler, signing out.